Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video we will do the practical of a temp and where temp directory where automatically housekeep will be done for this file to file system. As you already know for temp directory system do automatic cleanup after the uh, 10 days whatever the files will be there it will clean and same similar for the where temp whatever the files more than 30 days it will do housekeeping okay so to track this first let me write what i am going to do in today lab we will do the housekeeping of the file and directory which is more than um, 10 days for the temp and 30 days for the where temp and second we will take one file system and manually we will create files here if it is more than 30 seconds the file automatically will delete so let's start the practical we have already one server working the host name is server1 if you go to the location etc temp d so you don't have anything because taking the reference of this uh, this temp files t it will do the operations on the temp and where temp file system so we let's go to the one location which is usr lib temp okay and if you see there is a configuration file of temp conf copy this temp temporary configuration file at the location etc temp fs go to this location etc temp fs file just now you copied this file let's see what's inside if you see inside all the lines are comment except this four and this two the main important thing clear temp directory separately do to make this easier to override so if you see this temp directory it will clear after 10 days and similar for where temp it will clear after 30 days so just uh, let's do one thing just apply okay actually currently i don't have any of the files uh, files which is more than uh, 10 days or 30 days in my file system if you see all are related to uh, these are recent only 29 29 29 and these are all our directories so i don't have any files which is of older date but let's say if you have files which is which is already of old days what you have to do system d hyphen temp fs temps temp files hyphen hyphen clean and then temp configuration file so this way you can execute it manually and it will clear all your temps and where temps uh, file file system and whatever files will be there for 10 days and 13 days respectively it will clear from temp and where temp location so if you want you don't want to do this thing manually what you can do you can either place in monthly cron jobs so that automatically once in a month it will clean all the files from the temp and where temp file system so so as we are not going to do this uh, this practical is not possible for us so let's do using one an another example let's see how many file system we have available we have mnt file system let's create some files there maybe the test file of uh, november 29 today file write something inside this is test file save it okay so create one more file um, vi sorry touch test file 2 okay so now we have how many files two files are there let's create one configuration file clear the screen first let's see we, what we need to do you just need to um, you can mention any of the configuration file maybe i will write here as mnt cleanup cleanup for easier understanding dot c f conf conf similar like uh, temp conf conf okay i will i will do one thing i'll copy this line 
enter instead of temp it should be mnt let's you can give any of the permission depends and now let's make it 30 seconds 30 seconds okay and if you see if you go to the location mnt you can see here you have already files which you you did created Pre previously and it's it's almost one minute 57 we created now it's 58 okay so just let's run this system d temp files hyphen hyphen clean and uh, this uh, mnt cleanup dot config okay let's see in, uh, under the uh, mm, sorry let me see where we created let's see whether the content is there okay currently if you see there is no content okay because this uh, mount cleanup automatically uh, cleared the uh, mnt directory after uh, after 30 seconds just create one more test file test file 3 test file 4 date okay just need to wait for 30 seconds so now it is uh, already one minute gone let's run this command okay so let's see do you have file available there no file so by this way you can do housekeeping and if you want to schedule it using the cron job that is also you can do on hourly daily monthly basis or whatever basis so guys hope this uh, this video is very important and useful for you and uh, you definitely you might like this video if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and press the like and uh, bell icon thank you very much and thank you for watching